Welcome to my channel. The video explains the use of add or subtract or IP code in Xilinx Vivado. For using the add or subtract or IP, go to the project manager, click on create block design, provide any design name or Keep the default. This will open a new canvas where you can place the block level design and verify it. To get the adder subtractor IP into this canvas, Add the IP from here or from here. Another option is also available. You can right click and click on add IP. Search for adder. The adder subtractor IP is readily available. Double click on it. This is the available IP for adder and subtractor. Based on the requirement, change the inputs and clock enable followed by the number of outputs. Double click on this to change the properties. I want to perform a unsigned addition and subtraction. Set the mode to manual to enable all of these features. The addition I am going to perform is of 8 bit. A is of 8 bit. B is also of 8 bit. The add mode. You can choose to perform add, subtract, and dual functionality. Add, subtract. Right now, I am going to perform add, subtract simultaneously. Since we are implementing using lookup table, select the fabric. So these are the eight bit A and B. Then go to the control tab, enable the carry, disable the clock enable, and add the C out. Notice that a add signal is enabled here to perform dual operation for adder and subtractor. Click on this OK. See that you have A and B as the operands followed by C in and clock with sum of 8 bit and C out of 1 bit. This is the adder block, adder subtractor block which is available in the form of a IP. No program is written. It is available in the form of a IP. Now I want to verify the performance of this IP. Just enable the ports. Right click. Click on make external. You can change the properties of this. So I want to have the input as A instead of A underscore 0, B7 down to 0, clock signal as clock, remove all these underscores for our convenience, C in to be C in. 
and C out followed by sum or S. The design is complete. Then once the design is complete, click on regenerate layout followed by validate design. Validation successful, there are no errors. Once the designing is done, go to the sources. The design is a block design. It has an extension of .pd. Convert this into Verilog. For that, right click on this and select the option called Create HDL Wrapper. So let the Vivado manage it. Click on OK. Now the block design will be converted into Verilog. Observe that it is updating. Now the wrapper has created the extension .v which stands for Verilog. To verify this design or IP core, go to run simulation or click on the run simulation, run behavioral simulation for this. It takes a bit of time to complete this process. Once this is done, you have the waveform window. I want to put this clock ahead of all A followed by B. Add in and finally C in, add C out and sum. Let me apply the clock by using right click, force clock, leading value 0, trailing edge value is 1, period of the clock is 100 nanosecond. Then provide the input A, which is a constant. Right now, I'll provide the value which is of 8 bit 4 and 5. If you want, you can change it to binary or, or octal. Right now, I am providing it as hexadecimal. Click on OK, followed by the second input force constant provide the input to 22 see in value to be 1 i want to perform addition first so add or provide a constant value of 1. 1 for addition, 0 for subtraction. Now all the inputs are provided. Click on run for 1000 microseconds. Just fit it. See that the input is 45 plus 22 and C in is 1 
the total sum is 68 and we have 0 carry. The mode is 1 here. Let me change this mode to 0. Rerun the simulation. Let me minimize this. See, when the add signal came down to 0, the value has been subtracted. 45 minus 22. It will give me the result as 23. If you want, you can give more number of values to this input or for various values, you can perform addition and subtraction simultaneously. If you want, you can view the RTL implementation of this. Click on Open Elaborated Design. The RTL analysis or elaboration takes time. completing the preparation of all runs for launch. This shows the RTL level implementation of the adder subtractor IP code. If you want, you can see the inner content of this design. Still to the lowest level, these are all buffers. Finally, So this is the implementation of the adder subtractor IP. So you can click the previous to come out of this. Finally, this is the RTL level of adder subtractor IP.